Hi, I'm Carl Taylor and this episode is sponsored by Squarespace. Here's my commercial photography website. It's a Squarespace one and I absolutely love it. They are easy to set up, they look amazing, there are hundreds of templates to choose from and they have first class customer support. If you want one too, then use this URL and the coupon code CARL to get a 10% discount. So, we're in the new studio, we've got a lot more space and we have the lovely Freya back again. Here she is. This is the lovely bird that we did some animal portraits of last year with uh, Robert here. And remember last year we tried to capture her in flight and we didn't have much success because of the limited space in our old studio. So now in the new studio we've got all this additional space and what we're hoping to do is catch Freya in flight moving from this point here, flying across and landing at this perch stump of wood here uh, where hopefully she'll be attracted to the bait. The idea for the shot is to try and capture her with her wings apart, spread out as she comes into land here, using the big Para 222 to give a lovely textured light on the front of her, on her feathers with her wings spread. Got a couple of smaller Para 88s either side here to put a bit of back edge lighting onto her. And then also the fluter light, which is casting a ball of light onto the background cove there. You can't see that at the moment because it's too bright in here. And when we come to do the shoot, we're gonna have to turn all these lights off and dim it down so that Freya concentrates just on landing here. It's gonna be very tricky. We're using the super fast flash duration of the uh, Broncolor Scoro packs. So uh, we're running at about uh, 7,500th of a second flash duration. And that will hopefully freeze her in flight. So uh, we'll see how we go. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Freya. Hello, Freya. No, I didn't bother. I didn't bother taking that one. <laughs> unlucky look she went because she went towards me we had a good we had a good one there but because she... <laughs> no, it might be like on my head <laughs> okay so uh, well, let's just try again okay No, I haven't got the food. The food's there, Freya, look. <laughs> right, I think I might have been too soon, but at least the, yeah, I was too early, but the concept is at least working now. Yeah, so I was just a little bit premature there. too soon again. Ah, good. That's good. Too late. Missed it. Yeah. Worried that I'm going to miss it now. Okay, Fred. Last go. Last go. Let's go for it. <laughs> okay, uh, we're trying again second day with Freya. Um, there's only a certain amount that these Harris Hawks can be fed in a given day and yesterday we 
went beyond uh, the limit of how many times she could do this and how many times she could feed. Um, but Robert kindly has agreed to bring her back today. And today we're going to just try with her own perch because we thought that she might be a little bit more comfortable with her own perch that she's used to sitting on. So we're going to place the bait here uh, and, and then it's exactly the same principle as yesterday is try and capture as she approaches the bait here. Uh, we got some really good results yesterday, but we thought while we've got the opportunity, let's just uh, get another set in uh, and, and see what we can do uh, because there is only about 10 goes that we can get at this before she's not allowed to feed anymore. So it's very, very tricky, this type of photography. Uh, and um, I'm pleased with what we got yesterday. Let's see if we can improve on it today. She's got her eyes on it straight away. Even over your shoulder, she was... Uh... Oh, that was good. That's good. I think that's bang on sharp as well. She's still, yeah, they definitely, it's interesting. She does the swoop down. Oh, that's a good one though. She does the swoop down. Even from height, she does the swoop down. But that's great. She's come in, yeah. This one I really like from today, which we've only missed the wingtips again, which we can comp in and comp in on the tail, but that's quite a, quite a nice yeah, shape to her as well. The feathers look fantastic. But if I compare it to that, I think that, yeah, it's quite different, isn't yeah it? that really is the whole expanse of the wings. And it's, it's almost like a fashion shot with the <laughs> texture of the wings. And, and I think I'm gonna be able to bring out a lot more of this sort of detail, highlight some of these areas really lift that up. Um, we'll take out the bells on there. And I think that's going to be a spectacular shot when that's finally uh, finally worked up. So, so yeah, no, really, really pleased. Thanks.